Hello here, Internet. I'm Mr. Monogon, part of IGN Game Reviews. Today we're going to be reviewing first-person shooter games, the best and most important genre of video gaming, and first started with Halo and is what IGN is all about. Let's move on, shall we? The first game we're going to be reviewing is Bulletstorm, developed by A Software, I think. I don't really know, I lost the box, but hey, they look the same. Very, <laughs> very nice weapons and very wide variety and very nice looking graphics, I should add. But there's one thing I just don't get about it. The whole killing with skill, that leaves me confused because I killed everyone with every gun in the game and for some reason I could barely afford any anything in the store. Ah, <sighs> you were close, Bullet Storm, but you were not close enough. Let's move on to the next game! Blah, blah, blah. Now the next game we're going on is Team Fortress 2, a very stylized look for a kid game. However, when I first came in, there's one thing I know that there are no perks to speak of. How am I supposed to customize my character and go on a commando run without any perks? Hmm, oh well. There's another thing that left me very confused, is a la is a class-based system. I don't get that. Why would you be something like a medic, such a useless class, when you could be something like a heavy? This imbalance does not work. Let's move on! <laughs> now we're gonna probably reach the most unoriginal of the bunch, Left 4 Dead 2. A four-man fight for survival against an unending horde. Jeez, where have I heard that one before? Even though they added melee weapons and throwables, they removed other parts of the game that made it great. And replaced it with all these gimmicks more than Windows Vista, am I right? Yet, you're, you're supposed to laugh at that joke. That was a joke, by the way. You're supposed to laugh. Anyways, um, uh, moving on. Now, now, now we reach Bad Company 2. The worst of the worst. I knew the moment I was going this game, I knew I wasn't going to have fun. While they implemented parts of Call of Duty into it, and showed how much they wanted to cash in on some, another game's popularity, they then tried to <sighs> put in things like tanks, cars, and choppers. I don't see the point of that. Isn't that imbalance the game even further? <laughs> and then they tried to put me into a squad. <sighs> I can get kills myself, thank you very much. Okay. Now we reach Call of Duty, a wonderful example of a game made right, with an engaging story that's very well written despite its shortcomings, and a very inspection mo- an expansive multiplayer with a wide selection of original and unique maps, with original game types like Gun Game and Zombies. <laughs> Infinity Ward, yeah, Infinity Ward has your work out for them this time. This is a surefire game. <sighs> By the way, for those slow, this was a joke. We love all the games. Except for COD, that that can go suck an ass. So don't forget, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe! <laughs>